Hello guys, good day to you. Welcome to this new video. I'm Andrew from Your Hype Games, and this is the first video of a new devlog series. I started a new project, and this project is about a game that is a shoot 'em up or shmup. <laughs> For who actually knows this kind of genre and is on it. For me, it's a learning process, and I'll try my best to make a very decent game and actually, you know, make it fun. Hopefully. <laughs> right now it's November. It have been a few months since I've been working on this project. But everything started back then on July or August. That was the time actually when the idea came out. I was still working on Slime and Sliders. I was trying to finish it. And I just bumped on these videos where images were generated by AI. And I thought, hey, I said, I can use this to make assets generated by the AI. But everything actually is quite complicated because AI is quite stupid. <laughs> yes. Something that made me quite mad was actually the fact that I wasn't able to kind of have, you know, what I wanted in the perspective that I wanted. And text binding is kind of a skill that you need to acquire to make text understandable by the machine, actually. And the AI that I'm using is Midjourney. It gives you quite good results, and these are a few of images that I generated, actually. Guys, before we even go further, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. This means a lot to me, especially since I'm aiming to reach 2k uh, of subscribers. This was just on my, you know, list about good New Year's resolutions. But, you know, the fact here is that I wasn't able to get what I really wanted. Let's put it in this a better way. I actually get what I wanted, but it was not in the right perspective. It was cropped or somehow the image wasn't full, and these images weren't actually usable for a game asset. Now everything started, and I started generating some space and cosmo images, I started generating some nebulas, I started generating some spaceships, and look at those spaceships, they look amazing, they are cool, they are quite realistic. I wanted something from the top basically because I'm making a shmup and from the top nothing came out. The perspective there is bad. And all those spaceships actually are not that bad. I mean some of those can actually be used and I'm using them for my game. And I thought that it would be quite a good idea to have enemies that have an aggressive look with a lot of details on it. And those assets actually are very interesting and very good. They look awesome on the game, actually. While the player will go more for pastel colors, for more vibrant colors, and that's something that I wanted. And less details, actually. More cartoonish. That, that makes the difference between enemies and the player. Bads and goods, actually. And since we're working with AI, basically, I thought that it would be a great idea to have a title like AI Rises or AI Rising for the game. It has a very, very hard time to understand text, actually. Especially if he needs to print text. And you can see here that I had a lot of different text logos labels here and this text never matched at 100% what I was looking for. I just write it AI Rises or AI Rising and I never had the full world in a very understandable and good design actually. So this was kind of very tricky to, to have something. In the end of the day I just took something that looked very interesting and very cool. And everything is processed on Krita or Procreate. I changed a few things, I deleted, I meshed up, I made some image bashing together, and the results are quite good and interesting. In the next videos, we're going to watch a little bit about coding and the journey, how everything is going. Leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Subscribe because I'm putting out nearly daily some shorts where I actually show my progress in the game. Leave a comment down below to let me know what you think about my new project and more important tell me if you are using the AI 
in this way or are you thinking to make games with AR? Just let's share ideas and things because, you know, I really appreciate that. I'm Aaron from Yellowhead Games, thank you for watching and more important, keep devin' games!